Oh hey, this is Red Nitro Fire Gaming, and this is a challenge on the Porsche Cayman GTS. And first, I am going to tint the windows out fully. I've already done it. And for the wheels, I think they need to be more carbon, so that's kind of more cool. And that goes the same for the windows. I think I'm going to go for this now. Because I kind of like the silver here. But first, we'll be doing a little bit of an off-road design. For example, the car will be higher. And a few other tweaks with the tyres and stuff. And we'll do four simple challenges. And if the car can lift up to it and everything, it will be given a Red Nitro Ferrari star. So let's get on with the upgrading. First, with the upgrading, we're going to do the engine to be slightly more powerful, the camshaft, and I think this more powerful, and I think that'll be sensible, up to about 405 brake horsepower, and see if the brakes need doing. Let's do it anyway, but the suspension, we obviously know, is going to go higher, and that's how I expect it to go, and for the weight reduction, yes that'll be good and for the roll cage yes and it'll be slightly safe for the passenger and the driver and in the previous video i was actually not driving it was legendary dragon and for this car we'll have to put a rally transmission so it performs better when i drift it and everything because every time i drift it with a standard one it doesn't work very well so that's why it might be very slower. That doesn't even make any sense, but here we go. This is the car that will be driving me. And Legendary Dragon, even though he's not here. But let's get some cool rims. And think, these are my favourite. Yep, let's stick them on. And here we go. We have a awesome... Porsche Cayman GT. Who will win? Me versus the McLaren F1. And this is the second challenge. If I can get it working, of course. Yes, it's working now. And this is a CR car. And that must mean I've got a huge challenge on my hands. And I'm going to follow the car because I don't have the mini map. But I can guess where it is, approximately. And I think it's over there, exactly. I think it's over there and I'm gonna go off-road obviously because I have an off-road car and will I win? I think so I'm not sure at all but most likely if I can't see the F1 that means I must win if I was far away from it but never mind does not make any sense so I'm guessing where it is and hopefully the, hopefully you'll be entertained, the audience. And where am I actually? Turn left. I'm there, I'm here, I'm here now. Going against the McLaren F1. And this is a fun equaliser. It's raining now. And I know that cars handle differently. Right. And I think that has softer tyres on me. So I reckon... Ow, that's not nice that is. I'm going to rewind that. Because that's not fair that isn't. So don't smash me again. Smash into another car at least. But definitely, this is Ed Nitro Flurry driving. Because I drive better than Legendary Dragon. So, we need to get to the third challenge. Top speed. Final challenges are... Number three, top speed run, and number four, 
trying to do three 360 spins and totally obviously it is 1080 degrees I'm trying to do so this will be quite fun for the fourth challenge and I reckon the Porsche is up for it and the top speed run is for it to go at least 170 and I reckon it won't make it let's see I guess it was 168 because it won't tell you on here for some apparent reason but never mind we've got the 1080 degrees cha final challenge and I'm excited to do three 1080 degrees roll, roll and I don't mean 1080 degrees celsius or else that'll be too warm even for this planet and I don't think that'll be good so we're doing 360 not 360 1080 degree spin that basically means three 360 spins will the car do it? Aww. I think that counts at least even though it doesn't count the second bit but at least it was two and a half and I give this car well it's quite amazingly good I thought it was going to be better but never mind it's a Porsche that I quite like and I think they had a very similar one on Top Gear's one of its specials and I know that's the Cayman S but it was the same shape but a different year and a different model so buy from Red Knight True Ferrari please visit my website and please like and subscribe bye